Welcome students. I welcome all of you. Today we are going to discuss about the activity, project, assignment, and experiment. Okay. So let's see that one by one. Students, do you remember in month of June we had already given you one activity? Am I right? So what was that activity? If you remember the activity which was given to you, that was based upon the food pyramid. Do you remember what do you mean by food pyramid? This thing we had already learned in a lesson called as nutrition and diet. So in that lesson, in detail, we learned about the constituent of the food and the importance of the balanced diet in our day-to-day -day life. So what do you mean by balanced diet? The carbohydrate, proteins and fats, vitamin, mineral and fiber all these constituents should be in proper amount in our diet. So this is called as what? Balanced diet. So depending upon this balanced diet, depending upon the portion of this food constituent, we had learnt about the food pyramid. Which should be in the larger quantity in our food and which should be in the lesser quantity. Correct. So depending upon the nutrition and diet, we had learnt about the food pyramid already. So depending upon this only, you had to draw the food pyramid diagram on the chart paper. Most of the student must have already done that activity and you must have kept that ready. Am I right? So now time of submission has arrived. So you have to submit your activity. So those students who haven't done the activity, no issue. You still have time. You can do that activity right now and you can submit before time. One more thing student, keep it in your mind is that when you submit your activity, what you have to do, you have to scan your activity and after scanning your activity, you have to convert it into the PDF format like this. Got it? So after converting into PDF format, you have to send it to your respective division wise WhatsApp group. Is that clear? And one more thing, let me tell you that when you convert your activity in the PDF format, please try to mention your roll number and your division on the PDF format like this which I have shown you here. Is that clear? And again, when you submit your activity of food pyramid on your scanned copy as well. On your scan copy as well, on your uh, food pyramid chart also, there should be certain list which should be there. It will be easier for us to keep the record. So what are the four things which are mandatory which you have to mention? The first thing which you have to mention is that your name. Your name should be there compulsory, full name. Okay. At the same time, you have to mention your standard. You have to mention your division as well. And most importantly, you have to mention SID number. So these are the four things compulsory you have to mention. Is that clear? And what is the date of submission for activity? The date of submission of activity is before 21st August. Is that clear? So on 21st August before 8 p.m. You have to submit your activity on your respective division wise whatsapp group and on time submission is important students if you submit after the given date then your activity won't be considered is that clear so i hope so you already must have done this activity okay now after this activity today i'm going to discuss you uh, about the project the project which i'm going to tell you today that is going to carry completely 10 marks. Is that clear? So on which topic the project is going to be? The project is going to be on the topic of natural disaster. I hope so. You remember the lesson number 4, disaster management. Am I right? Which I have already taught you. In disaster management, we had already learnt about many type of natural calamities. Am I right? So there are many type of the natural disaster which occurs in our day to day life. Like you all are aware about the earthquake, then storm, then flood, volcano, 
सो देर आर मेनी वराइटी ऑफ द नेचुरल डिजास्टर विच हैपन्स एवरी सेकेंड इन आर सराउंडिंग करेक्ट सो यू हैव टू गैदर द इन्फॉर्मेशन अबाउट एनी टू नेचुरल डिजास्टर and you have to write it on the chart paper is that clear and one more thing what you have to do when you write the information regarding any type of the natural disaster you have to draw or you have to stick the respective images is that clear let's say for example if you are explaining about the earthquake then related diagram you have to uh, stick there if the diagrams is not available to you so you can even draw them okay so i am giving you option so choice is completely yours either you can draw those diagram or if it is available then you can even stick them as well okay so you have to write about any two type of the natural disaster you have to explain them and you have to stick their diagram or you can even draw them as well so for this particular project either you can refer your textbook lesson number 4 disaster management or if you are getting any extra additional information from anywhere you can refer that as well okay so this is what we are going to do in our project and the same thing for submission of project we are going to follow after your completion of your project again you have to scan your project and you have to convert it into pdf format like this okay so after converting into the pdf format you have to again send it to the respective division wise whatsapp group is that clear so this is your project which i am which i told you today and you have to do it in two days okay now when you submit the project for submission also student you have to follow the four methods you have to mention the four things so what are the four things which you have to mention first of all you have to mention your name as i told you already on your project paper as well you have to mention your standard you have to mention your division and at the same time you have to mention your sid number so even these four things should be on your project paper okay so if all these four things are there then only you will get full marks is that clear so here it is the project information which i have given you and most importantly the date of submission of the project when you have to submit this you have to submit the project on 13 august students note down these dates and what i am asking you to do after watching video you might forget all these things so i request you please note down all these things in your notebook so what is the date of submission 13 august and that to before 8 pm is that clear before 8 pm you have to submit your project not after that if anybody submit the project afterward then your project won't be considered is that clear i know you all are eager to do your project am i right so you all will do the project on time i know that so get back to your work and start doing your project on time okay and one more thing student after completion of the project we are going to do the assignment okay uh, on which topic we have to do the assignment you have to do the assignment on the uh, topic called as what types of the bones you don't have to write anything you just have to draw the diagrams of the types of the bone any four diagrams okay so what you have to do how you have to draw the diagram that part i'll tell you later in the next session okay but just remember right now you have assignment which is going to carry 10 marks and the name of the assignment is diagram of types of bone is that clear you have to draw the diagrams on chart paper and you have to submit them okay and again while submitting the diagrams of the bones you have to convert them into the pdf format and again you have to send it to the respective division wise whatsapp group okay don't worry you don't have to submit the assignment right now 
आई नो यू ऑल मस्ट बी वेरी टायर्ड विथ सबमिशन ऑफ द एक्टिविटी एंड द प्रोजेक्ट पार्ट करेक्ट सो आई कीप दिस सबमिशन ऑफ द असाइनमेंट पार्ट इन मंथ ऑफ सप्टेंबर ओके सो नाउ हैप्पी सो डोंट वरी दिस असाइनमेंट यू हैव टू सबमिट इन मंथ ऑफ सप्टेंबर नॉट राइट नाउ वॉट इज द डेट ऑफ द सबमिशन आई विल लेट यू नॉट आई विल लेट यू नो दैट लेटर ओके सो जस्ट रिमेंबर दैट एक्टिविटी सॉरी असाइनमेंट ऑन द डायग्राम ऑफ बोन यू हैव टू डू ओके एंड द सबमिशन इज गोइंग टू बी इन मंथ ऑफ सप्टेंबर इज दैट क्लियर एंड अगेन इट इज गोइंग टू कैरी हाउ मच मार्क्स टेन मार्क्स ओके एंड आफ्टर असाइनमेंट पार्ट यू हैव टू डू वन एक्सपेरिमेंट वी आर गोइंग टू कंडक्ट वन एक्सपेरिमेंट ओके सो इवन दिस एक्सपेरिमेंट इज गोइंग टू कैरी टेन मार्क्स सो वॉट इज दैट एक्सपेरिमेंट द एक्सपेरिमेंट विच वी आर गोइंग टू कंडक्ट दैट इज बेस्ड अपॉन द लेसन लेसन कॉल्ड एज द फोर्स एंड फोर्स ऑफ टाइप्स दैट वी विल सी इन द नेक्स्ट सेशन एंड फ्रॉम दैट पार्ट वी आर गोइंग टू कंडक्ट द एक्सपेरिमेंट which is called as what electrostatic force so electrostatic force experiment we are going to conduct in the next session so how that experiment is going to be what are the methods are required what is the uh, theory is going to be behind this activity and experiment all that thing we are going to learn in the next session when we will explain this experiment okay so don't worry this experimental part i will tell you in detail in the next session but just right now remember that you have one experiment and the name of the experiment is going to be electrostatic force so this type of the electrostatic uh, experiment i shall explain you in detail in the later part okay and again don't worry even the on the experimental part whatever i will explain you later you have to answer to certain questions and uh, those answer again you have to submit but again the submission is going to be in month of september okay so don't worry right now you have to just submit the activity and the project part is that clear uh, the experimental part and the assignment part submission is going to be in month of september okay but i hope so student you all understood in detail whatever project activity assignment and experiment i told you in detail i'll tell you once again what you have to do you have you must have already done the activity part you have to submit the activity of food pyramid you have to convert that into pdf format and you have to submit it to the respective whatsapp group and submission date is before 21st august is that clear after that submission won't be considered okay and after activity part if you remember you have to do the project you have to do the project on the topic any two natural disaster you have to explain any two natural disaster you have to stick the diagrams which are related to those or disaster again you have to scan that you have to convert that into pdf format and you have to send it to your respective whatsapp group and again remember when you send that you have to compulsory mention your name your standard your division your uh, sid number etc okay so do remember to mention all these things and what is the date of submission for project the date of submission of project is 13 august before 8 pm is that clear so 13 august is a submission of the project date please write down that is that clear and again uh, there is going to be uh, assignment which is based on the types of the bone you have to just draw the diagram you have to do nothing else and the again submission is going to be in month of september is that clear and after the assignment part you have to do one experiment i mean we i'll explain you that in the later part the experiment is going to be on electrostatic force okay and depending upon this experiment you have to answer five question and you have to again submit on the whatsapp group in the later on but again this kind of submission is going to be in month of september is that clear so i hope so student you all must have got an idea about activity project assignment and experiment in detail am i right i know you all are smart student 
you will do your activity project on time and i know i trust you you all are going to do submission on time correct so wish you all the best for your uh, submission we'll see you in the next session bye take care